Alright guys, I'm going to show you Left 4 Dead today on the 8800 GT. We're going to run a 1440x900 widescreen. Um, go to advanced. 16x AA quality. Uh, 16x anisotropic filtering. Vertical sync disabled. Multi-core disabled. Multi-core rendering disabled. Disabled. So, because I assume that's for SLR crossbar. If I'm wrong, you can go ahead and correct me and I'll make another one. Shader detail on very high. Effect detail on high. Model texture detail on high. Paged pool memory available on high. And I'm uh, done real quick. I'm already in the middle of a game because I've been, uh, I've been playing the Death Toll. I think this is Death Toll. Finale. Which is uh, the boathouse. It's called the boathouse finale. Keep an eye on the FPS up there in the corner. If you can see it, I hope you can. Let's return the game real quick. Just kill the tank. Let's get a pipe bomb here. Let's look at the Inside here we're getting around 73. Um, FPS is recorded with traps up in the corner. And uh, for those of you that did not does, do not believe that I have an 8800 GT, it is right there. I don't know if you can see it too well with the lighting. Let's get the cell phone light on it real quick. EVGA 8800 GT here. Um, runs the game 
pretty well. Um, it can do better, but if you don't have a lot of money and you see one on eBay or something like that, if you see one for under $100, they're an extremely good deal. Um, so yeah, that was uh, Left for Dead on 8800 GT. Peace.